Hey guys, welcome to the Fight Days channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. Thanks for supporting me, guys. The Briton will definitely not repeat the mistakes of the first fight. There are less than three weeks left until August 20th. It is on this day that Alexander Usyk and Anthony Joshua will meet again in the ring. Last time, the Ukrainian Douglas faced the Briton. Why many experts believed that the outcome of the rematch will be similar? In addition, rumors spread from Alexander's camp about how he broke his sparring partners, which gave the impression that Usyk was aiming for a knockout. We don't know what Usyk has prepared for the fight and whether he has changed anything compared to the last preparation, but we are confident that Joshua will come out to fight with a new plan written from scratch. To do this, a well-known specialist Robert Garcia was called to help. The invitation of this coach indicates that the Briton has admitted his mistakes and the desire to correct them. However, this requires not only knowledge of how to beat your abuser, but also drastic challenges within yourself in order to butt heads on a girl terms with a damn smart and smart Ukrainian. Let's just say that we are convinced that Joshua will come out with a new gameplay. Which is why we recommend not crowning Usyk ahead of time. But what does Joshua need to do to make the upset of the year? Works at the first number. In the first meeting, Anthony stood in front of Usyk as if rude to the spot. And he needs to block the air so that the Ukrainian has no room for maneuver and the movement. If Joshua actively presses Alexander to the ropes, then the probability that the Briton will get the Ukrainian will increase dramatically. Do not forget that 12 rounds or 36 minutes will be allowed to solve this problem in order to shake the reigning champion. Judge for yourself. Or is there a probability that Joshua will be able to get Usyk in 36 minutes? Throw power punches more often. If the Briton connects his striking power to high pressure and makes a bet on an account, Alexander will not have a sweet time at all. And a fighter except Floyd Mayweather feels uncomfortable under pressure. And then there is a pressure with a treat of lying down for a long time. This is a very dangerous mixture. However, there is a flip side of the coin. Joshua can get out ahead of time which Usyk is quite capable of using in the second half of the fight, if the Briton's plan doesn't work. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please, subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard absolutely every day, and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks for supporting me, guys. Reduction of muscle mass. That's actually what Joshua should be doing right now. Because of the muscles, Anthony only looks impressive outwardly. And in the ring he was wooden. It was for this reason that he moved rather stiffly. About this, by the way, not so long ago, former boxing world champion under World spoke. But Anthony has already done this once specifically for a rematch with Andy Ruiz. And he fluttered like a butterfly around the Mexican and he was able to regain his belts. It was also important to repeat this trick here. Otherwise, Usyk will fool Joshua again, or rather, the Briton simply will not keep up with the Ukrainian. Now, in order to compete with such a maneuverable and agile fighter as Alexander Usyk, you need to accept his rules of the game. If Joshua throws off his muscular corset and retains his striking power, then Usyk may not be well. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.